G'day and welcome back. I'm Drew from Gingo Productions, a freelance colorist working out of Melbourne. Today we're looking at a backup issue that you might run into while using DaVinci Resolve. So in this video, we're gonna go through what that error is and how we can fix it. So here we are in Resolve and here is our problem. DaVinci Resolve failed to backup. So this is the name of my file, LHTB, Last House to Ballarat. So now the problem is saying we don't have enough space on the backup that we're using. So the backup drive that is currently on my computer. Now these files are quite large, so I'm rendering them to get better playback. But obviously the problem is, is I can't get any playback because I don't have any space to play the files back because I've rendered it and ran out of space. So how do we fix this? Well, there's a couple of ways. First of all, we need to get rid of this. So just click okay. So this isn't a deal breaker. It's not gonna break your computer. So don't stress too much. It will keep popping up, which is obviously quite annoying. So the way I'm going to fix it now is I'm going to go to playback, come up to delete render cache. Now I'm going to go across to manage render cache data or data, depends how you want to say it, of course. So what we need to do now is find the projects that's using up all our render cache. So here we have one here, LHTB, so last house to Ballarat. Now I know we're still working on this project, but we're actually running out of space. So we have to change where this data is being saved to. So we can get rid of that one. Let's go down a little bit. And as you can see, this is our other one, 12.93 gigabyte. Now I know that doesn't sound like a lot, but unfortunately in the moment, my SD drive doesn't have a lot of space. So we need to delete both these. So now what we can do is go to clear cache to get rid of it. And as you can see, it's gonna delete all those files. So they're all done. Now go to close. So now what we need to do is we need to change the hard drive that it's being stored to, or that render cache is going to. So come down to project settings down here, little cog. Now under working folders, which is under master settings, we need to find our cache files location, which is this one here. So go to browse. So now we need to change it to a larger hard drive. So a DaVinci Resolve is not gonna have a heart attack. So come down to everything's meh. And I've already got one set up, DaVinci cache, select folder. Now go to save. Now, before we go to save actually, if you're gonna do some proxying, make sure you have this also saved. So let's go back and do that. So we can just chuck it on the same one and I'll make a new folder. I'll call it proxy. Double click that, select folder. Now go to save. Now every time we do a render cache, it is going to save to those larger hard drives. Now I always like to check to make sure Resolve has actually deleted all those cache files. So what I'm gonna do is find my cache file location and make sure it's all deleted. So now that I've found my cache folder, what we can do is left click and then right click on it and let's see how large it is. So now that we can see this folder is actually 68 gigabyte. Now this is a very large folder and this is where all that space is still being taken up. Now I'm not sure why Resolve hasn't deleted this. It is a new feature with um, delete render cache. So maybe they're still trying to work it out or maybe I set it up wrong. Maybe these are actually the proxy videos, not the render cache ones, even though it does say cache clip. Anyway, we can just delete these to fix this up. And we might as get rid of optimized media because we've changed the location. So we don't need this anymore. And then I'll just delete all those folders there, which will save us a lot of space. Alrighty, so now we've deleted all those folders and we have extra space on Resolve. So we shouldn't get that problem anymore. But what is the purpose of using SSD over hard drive? Why didn't I just use hard drive in the first place? Well, the answer is quite simple. SSD runs Resolve a lot better. SSD is a faster hard drive, so it renders your files easier, quicker, so which makes Resolve run a lot better. So in the future, I'll be upgrading my SSD to get a large one, so hopefully I won't have this problem anymore and everything will be gravy. Anyway, I hope this fixes any problems you have with that error, and thanks for watching. I've been Drew from Gringo Productions. Have a great day.